like to say. Help. <laughs> um, help, give us help. Please do not let our home sink. Home <laughs> islands. That's, that's mainly it. We don't want Kiribas to disappear. Mm. A place we call home. Yes. A place we grew up in. We feel secured on. That's, that's mainly our message. Um, help us not see Kiribas sink. My name is Sister Claire Anderea and I'm from the island of Kiribati in the Central Pacific and my island is only two meters above sea level and we have 33 islands and 100,000 people living in these 33 islands and I work with the youth more than two or three years now so that's my main work in Kiribati and we work together to promote and to bring awareness to our people about climate change. I have a fortnight to, to go to Bali and speak in Bali for my people. I have, have time around Australia to speak on the issue again to other people. And I feel so touched when people listen with the hear of their heart. You know, they, they, they really listen and they, they commit to do something. Yes, Kiribati is a very simple living place and what I love about my country is that the people are really happy and we have a, a unique culture and we kind of doing a lot of dancing and singing and celebration and yes, we have the community life living. Oh, the main thing that is happening is uh, is uh, sinking due to the sea, sea levels rising. And, um, Kiribati is mainly sinking into the Pacific Ocean, so maybe in a uh, hundred years or so, there'll be no more Kiribati. Uh, no we won't have any place that we call home. The, the high tide is getting stronger and higher, and because my island is only two meters above sea level, then this tide is keep coming and go into our well, then the well is become salty, so people can't drink from the well. A weather pattern has been affected. Uh, we, we don't ha um, have um, rain as much as we used to in our wet season, and you know, it's becoming more drought. And when the sea comes with a strong wind, everything, the sea went on to the, the land and destroy a lot of things. Our crops die, so people can't get their own food from their, you know, from their plants and, and houses falling down and trees, coconut trees falling down. That's a, the sad thing I witnessed it. We're so scared because we, it feels like we have no where to go, you know, because if we either move in, into land, we either in the ocean. So that's a, scary part of the experience. Most of our, my relatives, they live on the other outer islands, mainly where the education is not, it's not a primary thing for them. I don't think they have much option options. Options, yeah. I, I Only the they have. educated ones, they can seek uh, job opportunities overseas. Yes. But for the rest of them, that most of them, most of the Kiribati people don't have any education, so. With uh, them having no education, they'll just, they have no choice but just to stay on Kiribati. We don't want to be called climate <laughs> refugees. We want to, you know, to do something for ourselves and maybe, you know, for Kiribati. I want to maintain that culture because it's, it's telling me and show that who I am as a person. I am a Kiribati person, so that your own identity is important to to hold on it because that's who you are.
How, what, what feelings come um, to you when you think of not having that home anymore to go back to? Oh, that's they're deliberately sad. I, I can't imagine, you know, that there'll be no more home for me and, you know, for my for our future gener generations. I think it's really sad. Um, I just want to ask their help in preventing uh, Kiribati from sinking. Yeah. Um, our own Marlin, a place we call home, our home. We don't want we don't want it to disappear. We, we want it to be there. Yeah. Um, help us, help us not, help us in um, preventing Kiribati from sinking. This is the most crucial time for the world to take action to save my country. My people are the first victims of climate change, but we will be not the last. Climate change will affect all our grandchildren, no matter where they live, unless all the people of the world work together to find a solution. We can change climate change. Whether or not you're truly trying or why not Give it a shot, shake it, take control And inevitably wind up And find out for yourself all the strengths That you have inside of you